Rare scenes of normal daily life in Syria's capital, Damascus. An eight-hour truce has been held between a government-held district and an area controlled by the opposition, Sky News reports. Crowds of people from the Yarmouk neighborhood flooded into state-held Medan to gather supplies. But this is calm in the eye of a storm as Syria's bloody civil war rages on. This week, the US and Russia announced plans for an urgent international conference to push for a transitional government in Syria. British Prime Minister David Cameron is to hold talks with Russian President Vladimir Putin later today. The foreign minister of the Philippines has recommended that his government pull its peacekeepers out of the Golan Heights after four were seized by Syrian rebels on Tuesday. Filipinos make up around a third of the United Nations peacekeeping force in the area. The United Nations and Arab League envoy for Syria, Lakhda Brahimi, has praised the US-Russian initiative but cautioned that it's only a first step. Brahimi, who'd been on the brink of resignation, has also said he'll stay on.